Welcome to the Nicholas 11 X12 technology. Today we are looking at the 880 XPG G Series version 2.0 8GB DDR3 2000 memory kit. This is a high end memory kit with a pretty high frequency. I already unpackaged the memory modules. On each side of the modules it says 880 gaming series. Right here you will see the specifications. And right off the bat I have to admit the design is very beautiful and also durable. These are some heavy modules and you should also be able to overclock it a little further if you want to. But now let's just move on to the specifications. The exact model of this ADATA XPG G Series version 2.0 kit is AX3U2000GC4G9B-DG2 and it has a capacity of 8GB. These are 2x4GB modules. The type is PC3-16000U DDR3-2000. This kit has timings of CL9, 11, 927 and runs at 1.55 to 1.75 volts. Now let's move on to benchmarks. This is the test system I'm using. Here in CPU-Z I'd like to show you at which settings the kit is running. It attacks both modules so 8GB and they are running in dual channel mode. The DRAM frequency is 936.1 MHz, so I'm running the kit at 1866 MHz. I couldn't achieve 2000 MHz without overclocking the platform. This happens with all 2000 MHz memory kits. The timings are set 9, 11, 9, 27. For some reason it shows up 26 instead of 27 on the TRAS. But it's fine, once again these are two 4GB modules. Right here you see the timings table, as you can see the last one is the XMP profile which is 2000 MHz. I chose XMP in my bias but increased the voltage to 1.75 volts instead of 1.65. But now to get some results on the performance I'll have to run the ADA64 cache and memory benchmark tool for example. On the read I got 20,800 megabytes per second, 20,200 megabytes per second on the write and 22,800 megabytes per second on copy. The latency is 43.3 nanoseconds which is honestly pretty good, the lower the better. The processor is also benefiting from fast memory since the cache transfer speeds go up a little as well. I'm using an Intel Core i7-2700K Sandy Bridge CPU by the way. Once again RAM is set at 1866MHz and runs flawlessly on this Gigabyte motherboard. Of course I also tested with Maxmem 2 Preview which also shows great results. We are definitely talking of performance memory here, there's absolutely no doubt. The memory score is 21.07 gigabytes per second. In this test the latency is only 50.2 nanoseconds but it's still good. But an important question is, is it stable? Yes, I can confirm it's stable. It's one of the most stable kits I've ever tested. It runs great on every single motherboard so there's no compatibility problem. I've ran many stress tests and really it doesn't crash, it's perfectly stable. The ADATA XPG G series version 2.0 8GB DDR3 2000 memory kit is truly high end RAM. It proved it's stable, durable and it even performs great. For my taste the looks are great as well with that strong black heatsink and the black PCB. So it's definitely a great choice since there are high quality high nix modules on board. Pros are good price performance ratio massive performance, then it's perfectly stable and it has high quality Hynix modules on board. And lastly, I love the beautiful black heatsink and PCB. For the cons I have two things to say. First, timings could be a little tighter and secondly, the heatsink could interfere with CPU coolers. Other than that, I give this product a 9 out of 10 and definitely recommend it. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe.